Fala galera, sejam bem-vindos a mais um vídeo. No vídeo de hoje vamos falar sobre o Taco, como foi o melhor entre fragger do mundo de CSGO brasileiro. E aí, você já viu todos os cluts, highlights na era Taco, SK Game, Luminosity, Liquid? E você não viu e não sabe quem é Taco? Calma que eu vou te mostrar os melhores highlights dele na era dele. Foi sinistro. O auge do Taco foi absurdo e eu posso te provar isso aí. Os melhores momentos do Taco. E não se esqueça, se inscreve aí embaixo, é só um botão muito rápido e me ajuda bastante porque esse tipo de vídeo dá muito trabalho para achar todas as jogadas. Fechou? Deixa de enrolação e vamos aqui. Eu quis matar o Debs, ele quer matar o primeiro Ultimatic. Mas eu caí o meio nesse meio tempo. O Taco resolve agora os dois abates. Tem a esperança, tem a chance do round. 1x2, passa voando. Olha só a linda é movimentação aqui do jogador. Mas aí, opa, escapou do pulo do som agora. Vai ter outro pelo L. Já encontrou, já pescou. Vamos, Taco. É um por um. Já passou, já plantou agora XRM. E o Taco pode levar esse 1x4. Impressionante a movimentação do Taquinho no clutch. Já leva três jogadores no round agora. É só mais um. Ele vai abrindo. Ele sabe onde tá. Taco! E Nico's ready for the push through squeaky. Taco walks in. Nico can't quite land it. But now he's gotten there. So this is exactly the setup that was going to transpire. 46 seconds. Taco doesn't need to reface toward the A site. And he elects not to. Oh, he's still looking out toward A main. He could get caught in the open if he's not careful. Gonna stay wide side forward. That'll make it easy to see him walking in from the E-Box. Well, Top's gonna force him into the open. That's an easy kill. SP's almost thrown this one away. It's all on Taco with the AWP. He's gotta be aware of Config, though. He's gotta check his sides. Oh, and Config, that is dirty. Walking all the way into drop. He's gonna go for the long flag. Taco is never, ever, ever going to expect this. But would he hear him? Oh, Config makes it down quietly as well. This would be inhuman from Taco if he... Uh, what? Oh, oh no. no! Oh no! No! What is going on? What is... How has this round happened this way? 20 seconds now and Config's position's noted. Taco knows it. He's just to be buying time. And Taco now, 12 bullets left in his clip, lands the shot, Config. God bless. They're rushing in, turning around for the flashbang. Great timing there for Taco. And waiting, there's almost no time left. He's just hiding. He's just waiting. With two seconds left, he's going to be standing up, getting the headshot on one. And that might have been absolutely perfect. Taco getting the quad kill and saving the round. Brilliant play. In hand, can he make it work right now? I think he's worked it out. He's going to have to guess. He's going to have to gamble. And it pays off. Barely does he have enough time. This will be close. Oh, that was so incredibly close. 0.00. Definitely not very good here. On CT side of Mirage, Taco, oh, what a flick, oh, oh my god, Taco taking down Dennis. Trying to fall backup, backup is not going to be here in time, oh, <laughs> and that is going on, FNX, that's one of the most insane turnarounds we've seen for a while here, now Taco, one versus two, not quite sure where the remaining player is. <sighs> he's so good, Taco, snuff shocks when he comes around the corner, and now he's in position, he's going to have plenty of time to reload, 35 seconds left, it's Scream has to make the play, and it's Taco with the free fire, he hears him coming from a mile away, and I was about... The timing of this round is almost unbelievable, 22 seconds, and Taco's going to sneak the kill on the bomb carrier, turning around, Taco hits another shot, and now Magus get a one on three, Taco comes in with a triple, 13 rounds for SK, he steals it from the Danish team. ...do título aqui do classificatório brasileiro. Taco vai pegar o pezinho, controlou, já fez um entrando, já pegou o pezinho, tá bem funcionado, não ficava cego, se vai fazer estrago, olha o Taquinho, 3 kills, 4 pra ele, pescando de Desert Eagle, sem chance. Chance Saloon for the Polish side, a very, very weak buy indeed. Mihu, with the best weapon being an MP9, he does have a kit as well, but ultimately it's gonna need a bit of a hero play. Ooh, Taco on the off. An interesting choice, not the, the player that normally picks it up, but he was able to go ahead and use it efficiently early on by dropping Snatchy. To be cautious, of course, there is another player up close, but it's the players that are further away that he's going to go ahead and actually take down. Neo trying to swing in ends up getting completely shut down as well. Pasha could potentially be his next victim as Taco this time around gunning to try and actually find the ace. To do so is the question. Pasha underneath Palace could definitely be the one to try and put a stop to him, but it's just going to be so difficult for him to try and recover this round now, and it's just not going to happen. I really can't either. Taco doesn't want LG to be out of this one just yet. Says, I'll be keeping our, heart, our hands firmly on the pulse. And here we go, pushing forwards, and it's going to be Taco who gets a second and a third. Taco is stepping up in a big way. Guardian lands a nade into the pocket of him, though. Edwards there as well, and fallen. You've impressed us once, can you do it again? The bomb is down, so half the work is done for him. 
Two are about to line up. That's one. Course. This is the situation. Fallen. Last in the there place. It is. He has done it. He keeps it level. Fallen, the clutch man, the man of the moment, has brought it to 16 16. Everything pointed to Navi picking that one up. And that huge investment of that auto sniper yeah. falls flat. And well, to be fair, just yet. it gets the first two opening frags. It looked like that round was over, but somehow Luminosity come into the bomb side, find the AK kills, and give Fallen a. I have no idea what's coming up against him. But then Olaf Meister, very much the same. He's just hiding, and he wasn't far off that shot in me there. It looked like. Hey, grenade does go past a little bit. Taco now with the pistol. This is a great follow up. Oh my god, four kills. That is just a USP, Jason, and he just makes it work anyway. Can we get a really early ace here in the grand final? That would be great, and Taco's going to be in charge of it. What a message to send to Astralis. Berkway. Taco's one kill might be very influential because it did give up that big sniper rifle. Paul has gone down, though. Nice shot from Simple. The night show to fall. Taco doing even more work in this round. He's going to go for the spray. Only 40 seconds left. He picks up one more kill. That makes it a triple, and no one's even touched him yet. He hasn't got armor, so if Hiko lands a shot on him here, then that should be the, the open. You do leave it on the best clutch player you have, but so much time for Taco. Oh, and he wins Ooh. it! What is this? What? No Kevlar? Instant headshot from Taco on Hiko? And Hiko had the drop on him. A one versus three, yeah. saving your team. And given the circumstances, I don't even know how he's thinking straight. You have to remember, Taco is a player that when he was playing with the Brazilians in MIBR and formerly SK, he was known, to, he's always talked about himself being a supportive role, but that kind of really hit how much talent he has. He's phenomenal at reading the game and understanding when it's his turn to make a move. Got you right, trabalha bem pela smoke. E agora o Taco, para cuidar o combate. Apareceu, não viu ninguém, que se espantou C4. Taco, pega o primeiro, pega o segundo também. Vai pra cima do Get Right, sabe de onde ele vem. Taco, nas costas. Não consegue acertar o spray, mas já viu. O Get Right, troca de arma. Se reposiciona aqui um pouquinho o Taquinho. Ele não tem defesa kit, não tem tanto tempo perder, vai partindo pra cima dele, Get Right se esconde, espera lá atrás, olha o defuso, a gente tá no chão, Taco faz agora o clique da C4, força o Get Right a se reposicionar, a avançar, soltar os disparos, o Taco ainda espera aqui o momento certo de dar o combate, o Get Right não acredita que ele está desarmando, e a equipe desse cara vai sofrendo, o Taco vai pro desarme direto, Get Right procura, e o Taco encontra... Taco in the boost position, we'll see whether he can get some frags from this, there's the first one, not messing around, not letting players pass, just going for every single kill, and that's exactly what Taco is going to get. That's four in a row for him. Where is the response from G2? Shocks, he's trapped behind the door. Able to get of timing, not in his favor, and he's done for. Alu just jump peeking it. Gonna spot it out. Taco finds him. That's, a, I guess, a step in the right direction, but there's gonna be a lot more steps here on what might be a mountain, but there's a leap. It's gonna be the scary thing he just has to go for it, so no, he's actually gonna come out towards. Is oh, he? Oh, no, he's not. He's baiting it out. This so is smart. Sick. He's got four kills. He, gotta, he has to go for the ace here. He's gotta get all five. Did he spot him? I don't know if he spotted him, but either way, he's making the right read. He knows he has the smoke down lower, so Taco... Every single position he checks, every angle contains a threat, but would you predict Taco to take a fight here? Confidence aplenty, and we'll see if it pays off, and he gets it! That's a sick ace from Taco! Nine back the pistols. That's the benefit of winning around like that. Oh, this could get interesting, though. Stewie does find one kill towards Fur. Taco in the pit, though. Neutralizes the situation. Good incendiary. That's going to force Automatic to face. Punishes him at the same time as well. If he can find one more, like he does, that's pretty much going to secure the round. You know what? He might get all of them. He's anything. SK Gaming, though. They have two men still in position. And look at that headshot from Taco. Taking down Device. That is a fantastic way to get started. Especially dropping Device. And now they're starting to rotate in. SK have a really good read on the situation right now. They know this is going to be a beat hit. And all of that distraction from Astralis hasn't really helped them at all. Taco landing one more headshot. Taking down Dupree. Looking for a third. He's calmly clicking away. There's a third coming in. Taco doing more. Fourth headshot. And the round has been won. SK Gaming. Decim and armor needs to hold off does have the bomb in his vision no smokes to hold him at bay one kit Kerrigan's already tagged so too is Olaf they're gonna have to hit a perfect shot they can't do it Taco goes oh! back and he's tech nine from range 13 for SK 11 to 4 here they go looking to start strong and Lucas and Nekas have done just that it's a question on mid and that question is coming up CT just called Zera trying to be the last Port of call, he can't do too much more, just the one, and now Taco, yeah, that's the, uh, should have been the end of that, he's low as what? well, Taco, drive by on steel, he's holding the Glock sideways, oh! and another one, Henny, shut down, and
Taco finds faith for a Can't deliver more than one though. First stepping up and fallen. Why a game so far can mid up PT fast to do anything. Scrappy a bet, but Sunny comes out on top, he'll start the drop here. Taco takes him down, two versus two. Even a jumping burst clock just to hit one bullet, and it didn't land. That certainly does from Chris J. Now, Fur goes down. Chris yeah. is the player that didn't have the armor, and he wins that duel cleanly. So, well, job well done by him. I think Taco spotted him still in the sight and oh. erased him. So is he erased to Robs. That's brilliant shot to Robs. Nitra жмёт, и получается у него там двое битых игроков, даже трое битых. Воу, Тако! Маха, Ешка, брависим, а так и думал, что снесет лица просто, просто. Charge coming in. Cold has is the only one to be successful. Keeps are coming in from the back. Tako should allow the bomb to go down. There was a lot of onto Kusta. Oh wow, three players, 15 bullets. Oh, they're gonna line up for him. He can actually switch to the Tech Nine now. He's got 20 bullets in that six HP. No way, Tako delivers. Ridiculous there. This what is this? Cold crouching behind the box. He can make all the difference here, and sure enough, he picks up one. They're coming for the smoke, though. Furfell, he had to react. There's only four seconds. He's around the box, trying to see if he can get the plant down. Tackle the head shot. Slave coming out, but Tackle's a hero. Taking 15 seconds remaining. Cold Zero set alive there, doing damage. So is Taco. Nice shot. They were away from Mixwell. It's less of a fact now as HS gets in position, but still goes down. Taco finds him just before he gets back to the stairs. That means Mixwell has to take oh, the fight. Yeah. Can't do it. Taco finds both, and it's 5-1 for SK. And the timing and the HP as well. They can't be slow about this. They have to give up their position, and Olaf is going to end cold here. Now Taco does take him out from behind. There's one member so incredibly close. There could be no way. Oh, no! What is happening? He actually gives them crap! Controle agora de recoil. O Tato vai levar, parece nas costas. O Tato pegou primeiro, pegou o segundo. É o Lampião do CSGO! E o Fai não erra aí. Ele não erra esse tiro. Ele não! Acabou errando por conta de uma flecha na sequência. E é Highlight! For the Brazilians, it's going to be a big turnaround there. Hits the headshot on Sousa. Now it's a one on one. Guardian versus Taco. It may just be destined to be. And it's Luminosity winning their first major championship. E aí, curtiu e finalmente conheceu como foi a era do Taco? Então não se esqueça, deixa o like, comenta aqui embaixo que é muito importante e comenta aí o próximo jogador que você queira ver nessa série, fechou? Tamo junto, te aguardo no próximo vídeo e fui!